Their brains were smaller than an orange, yet buried their dead. That shouldn't be possible. In 2013, deep inside South Africa's Rising Star Cave, archaeologists made a discovery that shook human history. To reach it, you crawl through pitch-black tunnels, barely wider than your shoulders. And at the end, a hidden chamber filled with over 1,500 bones from a species no one had ever seen before. They named it Homo naledi. They walked upright. They may have used fire. They might have even carved symbols onto cave walls. But their brains, only about 500 cubic centimeters, closer to a chimp than a human. And yet, the bodies weren't dumped. They were deliberately placed, again and again, deep in the darkness. Intentional burial from a species with a brain the size of an orange. That's like finding out a hamster built a spaceship. Burial rituals were supposed to require big brains, modern thinking, but Homo naledi defied that logic. They went into those dangerous caves with no natural entrances and left their dead behind on purpose. Scientists are still debating what it all means. Did these ancient humans understand death? Did emotion, grief, or symbolism evolve before intelligence as we define it? So maybe it's time to rethink what a smart human looks like. Because Homo naledi might not have been primitive. They might have been something else entirely. A forgotten branch of us. With secrets we're only just beginning to uncover.